Hi everyone and welcome back to our Vortex tutorial series. I'm Jack and today I'm going to be telling you all about file conflicts, what they are and how you can use Vortex to solve them. A file conflict happens when two mods are trying to change the same file. For example, if you've got a mod that changes a piece of armor to be green and another that changes the same piece of armor to be red. When this happens, Vortex will prompt you with a notification so that you can try to resolve it yourself. A conflict is indicated by this red lightning bolt. To resolve the conflict, click on the More button in the notification or on the lightning bolt itself, and you'll be prompted to set a rule. The rule will specify which mod is loaded after the other and therefore wins the conflict. The lightning bolt then turns green to show the conflict has been resolved. Vortex though can go further, allowing you to select individual files within the mod to resolve the conflict yourself on a file by file basis. For example, if you wanted all of that armor to be green except for the helmet, which you wanted to be red, you can do that. It's a little bit outside the scope of this video though, but there's a link in the description and on screen right now that'll show you how to do that. When setting rules to resolve a conflict, Vortex will give you the option of letting it suggest a solution. It can decide which mod should be loaded before or after another based on the age of the files within the mod itself. If that doesn't work though, or if you've set a number of rules that contradict each other, you may be faced with a notification that mod rules contain cycles and this slightly daunting graph. Don't worry though, it just means that a rule that you've set is causing a cycle, forcing Vortex to loop back on itself. With the graph on screen, you can right click a mod and select Highlight Cycle to see specifically what related mods are causing the issue. Then right click the mod that you want to load last and select Load Last to clear those individual conflicts. So there you go, file conflicts. Not that complicated once you understand what's going on. And if you want to understand what else is going on at Nexus Mods, then check out the rest of our channel. We've got loads of videos on all of the best mods. See you around.